And a group including prominent scholars and writers spoke out today against the trade and service pact Taiwan signed with China. They worry that China's greater size and lack of freedom will pose threats to publishing in other industries in Taiwan. National policy advisor Rex Hao wants to know why the government took a backdoor approach to negotiating the trade and services pact with China. Why was this process conducted in a non-transparent manner? There must be an important reason for this. Only something significant could convince the government to turn its back on the democratic process. Journalism professor Zhan Jinghua of National Taiwan University worries about a threat to freedom of speech. China is a large economic entity that may be on a political mission. Will they be intolerant of other opinions? Will they try to suppress other points of view? Writer Giddens Ko was asked if he thought his outspoken opposition to the pact would lead to a ban in China. I hope that's not the case. What I like about Taiwan is that you can speak to your heart's content. After saying what you want, you get discussion and commentary in return. Those taking part in the press conference urged separate public hearings for each affected industry. They said before evaluation reports are complete, the legislature should neither review nor vote on the pact.